Hey, Mr. Kill Street's in here back my left side, there's another. Oh, shut up! Let the Batman world, you know what I meant. Okay, now let's kill these um, Nightmare from Christmas ripoffs or whatever it is. I don't know, uh, I don't know if you've guessed me, it's like a um, uh, graveyard theme. Just a hunch, but I think it is. Anyway, watch out for Clyde! It's the orange ghost, that's what it's got. Inky blinking. Clyde. I just get what the one's called. Anyway. Eh. <laughs> like, um, yeah. Very interesting levels, these. Now, this is pretty much where the game starts to get a lot harder. <laughs> this game can get quite hard, but if you're an idiot, if you're careful, it don't, it's not too bad. You need to concentrate. Soon so they are invincible unless they fall over. There's a big moon in the background. I'm trying to think of something that I can. Um, yeah, so that's pretty good. I don't have to say. But when the 3D effect really starts to screw you over in this level, you'll be so. Trust me. I mean, oh. So apparently this might be a castle. This, this stage looks like most Castlevania almost. Clyde! Um, and also, I remember one game they were going to make for the DSG game, Castlevania. I can't remember what it's called, but things would depend. Different things would happen depending on if it was light outside, so it was like a solar panel on it somewhere. I can't remember what it's called, but if it was like light or dark, you'd have different abilities. It sounded a pretty good idea, though. Didn't work out unfortunately. Okay, get the apricot. Now this is where you will start to be screwed. I don't mean in the good type of way. I mean 3D way. And as you see I'm down to two lives, we've got to be very careful. Okay, watch out for the those guys fire in their fire. Jump down the hole. See 3D effects. I thought it was going up. It looks like it's going up, you have to admit. It. Now, when I do cuts now, I'm going to make it a bit more, um, what's the word? I can't remember the word. I'm going to make it look a lot more, less obvious, or better. It'll look more professional, that's the word. Anyway, up here, it's like, yay, I was like, oh, I didn't really think I would bother, but you need the key. So I decided, let's drop back down, or die. So I got down one life. Damn. Okay, let's go. See? It looks, it looks a lot better, that car. Oh, I didn't realise that. Damn it! Anyway, this no joke, I'm actually getting really pissed off by this point. By these annoying. These platforms may remind me of like teeth or something. I don't know. Just like that tooth on there, or one. Or a cloud. Actually, why is it this weird? I mean, we're in the middle of a cemetery, graveyard, slash bollocks piece of shit. Um, Sorry, I'm sorry. I don't know what it's supposed to be. It could be the nightmares of the deceased. Mwah! The nightmares of the devil. Or the dreams of the devil. Even, even monsters have nightmares. They have them of me. I am in their nightmares. <laughs> that's how scary I am. No, so that's, that's a clay, but I'm not gonna. It's not a good game. Okay, get the keys. We all like keys, and we know this this key is for this little um kid that was coming to your party. It frees that guy. I, I don't know what relation he might be your son. He could be just some random kid. Yeah, kid, yeah, kid. Now, what you may not realise is. For this type of game, you're very wondering why are there no um, bosses? Well, in the original PS1 version, as some people will know, there were at the end of it. In fact, there was a stage select layout where you could you walk around the whole stage and right, I'll do that stage and I'll do that stage, and then there'll be a boss. So in the first world, you have to do this really cool. But in this, there doesn't seem to be any bosses. I'm not even sure there's gonna be a lot. Well, there might not be a boss. Oh, that's just thing. Look, that was a perfect cut. 
Anyway, <laughs> I'm not sure there will be um a final boss. <laughs> kind of hope there is, because it'll be good. But if there's not, I'm not going to This is just uh, help you to tide over to the boss, which I don't know when it's going to happen. Yes, a life. We need that. We need that moment. No, nah, probably not. But anyway, you don't want to fall. If you fall, you're just going to go down into the pit of despair. And you will not return. Ever. This game is probably getting tedious for some people. Unfortunately, we've got another graveyard stage, but we're nearing the end, so you won't have to put up with this much longer. I mean, I was getting really annoyed at this point. I was just like, come on, let's get to the end of this bloody piece of poo. That's the unclean version. I really didn't realise I was pressing down the space bar to make it speed up. But you can't see it on here because we can't. I made the music so it's not too loud and it's quiet. It's quite a nice volume and you can hear my beautiful voice. La 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 la. <laughs> so, hopefully, it's possible that soon. If you want something to tide over, hopefully, Flame Kid should be doing a few more soon. I didn't be able to get up with lazy fat ass. So it's under one three weeks, but anyway. We're not allowed to talk about people. No chef helps in this LP. Or pac you. Um, pa Pac Man, don't. Uh... Okay, um, get that, yep. Now let's go over these Castlevania style fences and kill um, Jack the Ripper's dead body, his walking corpse. You can't get up there, trust me. Okay, we need a we need a bell to get into that door. There's Inky, the ghost, and Pinky. How was it? Pinky. It's such an obvious name, but it's quite hard to remember. And she looks like there's been a solar eclipse that moon. Looks like. It's in the background, that moon looks like there's been a solar eclipse, or lunar eclipse, probably. More likely. But I don't really care. Frankly, I don't give a damn. Wow, look at points. It's over! No, no, no. No, oh, watch this. Oh, I'm so clever. I was getting myself killed. But anyway, we've got 167,590. That is a lot. You know what a lot? We'll just add, add a whole other suitcase of a lot. And you that's how much we've got. Yeah. Anyway, go back. And oh my god, Pac-Man. Get those nice two cherries. Those nice plump cherries. <laughs> oh mate. And behind this all is a metal ball. A big ball. At the end. AM. Yeah, the stage is pretty long. You know, basically, just run along these coffins that may have the remains of Pac Man's wife in. So her, his, her arm will be in one, her other arm will be in the other, both her legs will be in one of them each. And yeah, they've sent him uh, back to him piece by piece. Because that's the way that guy is. Okay, now those. This is what I am. Ah, oh, that's sexy. Um, sorry. Basically, you just go left. That 3D makes it look like it's in front and to the left. Actually, it's just like that. To the right. It, it is absolute... It, that is the definition of a dirt. Freaking... Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Pac-Man. Still, this is a good game. I'd recommend it. Out of 10, I'd probably give it that one. Well, this version I give out I don't know, 75, but the PS1 version is a lot better. The 3D graphics are slightly better. I'd probably give it about 82, 83. When it first came out, I would have. Now it probably would be a bit less now, but it was good when it came out. Not how much I'd rate it. I still give it 82 actually, just because it's a quality platformer. Like, really, if you have a PS1, if you're living in the dark ages, you know. Um, and yeah, PS1. I'd recommend Crash Bank for a decent platform. And also, um, Ape Escape is a good um, game for PS1. Oh, yeah. That game is probably. I'm sure. Anyone played Ape Escape? 
Yeah, the apes escape. Oh, it's such a huge game actually. It can last, it last you ever. I actually got a PS1, I tried playing it and then realised that I bought um, a controller without analog sticks. <laughs> and I was like, no, I can't play it because I don't have the analog sticks. Anyway, I'm just going to watch 27 watching. I'm just going to link to You're watching the Pac Man. See you next time where we'll do the last um, graveyard stage, two more, and then the final stage if there's a boss. If there's not, then that'll be it. And then we'll do links to past and then something else will happen that I'm not going to tell you yet. I don't know. See ya.